Hey everybody, it's Michelle again, and I've got more Bath and Body. So I just want to say thank you so much to all of the Bath and Body people who are still here. I know for a long time I've been doing um, Diamond Art Club videos and my Bath and Body um, subscribers have stuck around and I just want to say thank you so much because it's been a while since I've put up um, very many Bath and Body videos and um, I'm going to try to uh, throw a few more in there. Um, I had someone comment that they want to see the videos no matter what. So um, I'm going to do that. When I make an order, I'm going to show it to you. <laughs> so anyway, um, I just wanted to thank everyone, everyone for sticking around. Um, so I got my order in the, or uh, delivered my, the order that I made online. Um, I want to tell you, first of all, I am wearing Wrapped in Vanilla today, and I've been wearing it off and on here and there because I have a cream that I wanted to finish off before um, before uh, it got too warm out. Um, and so I just cut the bottle open so I can finish off what's in it because I always do that. There's a ton in there still. Um, it is so fantastic. That is one of those. I know Bath & Body doesn't watch my videos, but that is one of those um, scents that they need to bring back. It is fantastic. That is the best vanilla I have ever smelled. Hands down, it is delicious. I do like that Viva Vanilla I just got though. It's good. And also, my mom and stepdad are snowbirds. So they just come back um, end of March, beginning of April. And they brought me back, me and my husband, sweatshirts from or Orange Lake um, Resort in Florida. They go to Florida or Texas somewhere every year in the winter time. And so mom, I'm wearing the sweatshirt, I love it. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, now on to the Bath and Body stuff. Um, just in case mom watches the video. Anyway, <laughs> on to the Bath and Body stuff. Um, so let's just start with this. I've got, oh, you know what? I was gonna do the lip products first. Okay, I think this is the only thing of this in here. So um, I had forgot when I bought the other um, Gingham Unstoppable stuff, I had forgotten to get the shower gel and I always get the shower gels for my husband. So um, I got the shower gel. Uh, this is actually two orders. Um, one of them was the 40% off. I did get this in that order. Um, and I don't remember what all. I got a perfume in there and something else I don't remember. But anyway, most of this is from the sale the other day, $5.95 sale. Um, but this was in the 40% off sale because he needed it, you know, so he could wear this and try it. He's not a big fan of this, though. Um, he'll wear it because I like it. He's not crazy about it. Um, I do like it, though. So, mm. I got some lip products because I am, I collect them, I guess. I buy them, almost all of them. I really, really like the um, CO Bigelow products and I use them all the time. I use them every day. Um, I got the Mint Lip Balm, uh, CO Bigelow. Um, it's got some grubby stuff here because I pulled the sticky off of it and it's, ugh, you know how they are, <laughs> but anyway. It is fantastic, I love it. You got a little bit of chapped lips, put that on. Oh, and they tingle your lips a little bit because it's a, the mint in it, you know? Okay, I got the vanilla lip balm. It tastes like vanilla. It's nice. I love these CO Bigelow um, lip products. They're fantastic. So I buy almost all of them. I did get the Toasted Cherry Donut Lip Gloss. It is just a lip gloss. It is not sparkly, no glitter or anything in it. Um, it's in this cute little heart um, bottle. It is kind of hard to get much on there because it comes out with very little on the on the thing, but not that you need a ton. Um, and yeah, see, a lot of times when you pull it out, there's almost nothing on there. But uh, anyway, it, it does, you can get enough, but it just, you gotta pull it, put it in back in there a couple of times, but it tastes fantastic. Oh, that is good stuff if you wanna, you know, if you lick your lips 
whatever, but um, it's just a gloss. I just, it's playful, it's fun. So I got that. Now, I'm not saying that the lip products were a great deal. They were not, they were not a fantastic deal. I just, um, I just like the lip products and they're not on sale a lot. And a lot of times when they have the mini things on sale, I don't catch the sale. I don't look at it every day like I used to, I should, because then I would get a much better deal on this kind of stuff. Because um, they put them on sale for like $2.95 or $3.25 or something like that. It's a much better deal than what I paid for them. Regardless, I only buy, bought a few of them. This one is just the um, Iced Lemon Pound Cake, just lip gloss. Again, tastes fantastic, like a cake lemony cake kind of thing. Um, it's just a gloss. I have a ton of them. I don't know why I keep buying this stuff. I don't need it. I have a bunch of it. I just like it. I like to, I like it. I don't know. Anyway, moving on. I decided with the $5.95 sale that I would try the Sweetheart Cherry. I'm not a big cherry fragrance fan. Now, um, I did smell this. The other day I sprayed it in the cap and let me spray it again because there's something, something all over it. I don't know what that's from. You do, oh, I do know what it's from. That is, look at the back of this. That label is terrible. It's all over everywhere. See how it's all coming off and can you see that? That's what is all over the place. The label is like destroyed. <laughs> I don't know what happened to this spray, but it's not in good condition. Anyway, um, yeah, it's all over my hand. I don't know if you can see that, but anyway, the smell though is nice. Yeah, I can't read, I can't read the fragrance notes from that, so. Okay, wild cherry, crushed pistachio, and whipped vanilla. It does smell like a like a fruit salad. Not fruit salad, but like a cherry pistachio kind of salad. It doesn't have a real strong cherry scent, though. It's like at first you get the cherry scent, and then you get more of the pistachio creamy kind of smell. It's nice. I do like it. And maybe with the cream and the you know, and the fragrance mist together, it'll be, you know, just even better. I don't know. You know, we'll have to try it out and see. I haven't worn it yet. So I bought the cream and the fine fragrance mist, which is, ew, it's a mess. I'm going to have to take that label off or something because I <laughs> get it all over your hands just touching it. So anyway, Done with that, I bought a In The Stars scrub. It is the Exfoliating Glow Body Scrub because I like their scrubs. I use them every day, almost every day, usually just on my feet. Um, I'm not a huge In The Stars fan, but I do have some, and so I thought, I think I have all the other scrubs that were available, <laughs> or the ones I wanted. I don't like the walnut ones that are like sand because that stuff, it sticks all over in my tub. I take baths um, and it leaves a mess all over everywhere. So I don't like it. Um, but anyway, I do like these. They're not as exfoliating as I would like them to be, but um, and they could use a little bit more, but uh, I, don't, I think these are the ones that, I don't know, anyway. <laughs> Anyway, but, and the glow, the glitter in these, that doesn't bother me at all because it just rinses off in the tub mostly. So I don't know. I've heard people complain about that, but all right. I got my vanilla blooms. I should have done my video yesterday because I wore, I could have used this in my shower, my tub today. Shampoo to go with. If you watched my other video the other day, I have the, I had gotten the conditioner. My hubby got it at the store. So they didn't have the shampoo. So I ordered that one online. I also got, <laughs> check this out, two moisturizing shampoos 
for Gingham Gorgeous. This is my favorite, absolutely favorite scent from um, Bath & Body Works. So I got two shampoos and two <laughs> conditioners. So I'll probably keep one at home and put one in the camper and I'll have them used by end of summer probably. Oh, here, I got another lip thing. This Nourishing Lip Shimmer um, Lipstick. It's just um, clear, uh, glittery, it's sparkly. So I don't know, just thought I'd try them. I think I have one already. I also got the Gingham Shampoo and Conditioner. And whoops, dropping it, dropping it. Okay, these. Okay, this came in, this was the $5.95 sale. Um, dressed in white spray, because I, I didn't have that. Yeah, when I ordered the other stuff, I was waiting for the sale to get this. So I had just now gotten this, and then the 40% off sale, all over everything, that label. Um, I got the dressed in white perfume, and I like the perfume a lot more than I liked the cream. When I tried the cream, the perfume smells much better. So, yeah, it's nice. It is real nice. Now, um, whether the, let me smell the spray because who knows, the, um, the body spray may be just as nice. Okay, see, I smell something different with the body spray than I do with the perfume and that I did with the cream. So, I do like this, though. Um, I didn't like the cream as well as I like the body spray or the perfume. I like this a lot. It is uh, almost like a... What are the scent notes in this? Pear Blossoms, Ivory Gardenia, and Satin Woods. I don't know. I, it smells, it reminds me of something. Something from like, it reminds me of something from like when I was younger. What is it that I'm thinking of? I, I can't place it, but it's a nice smell. But I think, um, no, no, I can't smell that. I think that the perfume, I only had to spray one spray of it. It's almost got, when you first smell it, it almost has like a, a citrusy smell to me. And I don't know why, because it, there's no citrus. It almost smells like lemon. At the very first smell of it. But then, but then I get a really nice floral smell from it. I'm sure that the lemon thing is just a mixture of it all and it's just in my head or maybe it's a mixture of um, everything I've got on today and then I'm spraying this and smell and I've smelled several things. It's probably just my nose but um, because there's no lemon in any of this. But look at that bottle. Isn't that beautiful? It is a really pretty bottle. Um, let's see if I can get it closer because it doesn't look as um, blue you can't see the blue in it as well from far back. It look well anyway to me. It looks more white, but if I get it closer, you can actually see the how pretty the bottle is. Anyway, I thought it was pretty. The box isn't um, real fancy like some of the others. It's just a it's just a box, but it does say blushing, romantic, and unforgettable on the inside of it on the the um, thing here. And see it there. Um, I always keep the boxes because their boxes are usually kind of neat. So that's the box for that one. It's not anything special, but I will keep it anyway, just just because I keep all of them. So um, it was kind of expensive, uh, $59.95 it says, but um, with 40% off. And then I believe did I use a coupon with this sale? I don't remember now which sale I used a coupon for and which I didn't. I'm not sure. So, um, 
it wasn't too bad with the sales and everything. And that is my haul. So um, not a ton of stuff, but with all of it together, it was a ton of stuff. <laughs> but I was anxious to do this video so I can get everything put away. So I just want to thank everyone again for, um, for watching my videos and for sticking around all this time. And um, I hope everyone is having an absolutely fantastic week. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. And um, that's all I've got for today. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.